Great question. So most people know that the expected return on stocks is higher than fixed income. But most people probably should know that they need a financial plan. And a financial plan will tell you what's your required rate of return. So most people might say, well, I want to retire at age 65 with a million dollars or whatever. So they might say, well, that means I need to be 100% stocks. That's a mistake. You have to figure out first, how much do you need and what's your capacity for risk? Because the more stocks you have in your portfolio, the more risky it's going to be. So if that's a situation where you can't actually retire with the rate of return that you're comfortable with, then you need to change your financial plan, not your portfolio.